Hi. Uh, hi. Uh, please introduce yourself. Uh, I'm Nozomi Kijia, working at Murata. And what is the coolest new technology here, the embedded world? Okay, uh, we have a 6 CGS radar module, it's, which is the very smallest and high performance radar module. Uh, can we see it? Okay, of course. So it's a module that does what? That's oh, right. Uh, let me try to get close to it. Yeah. So, what does it do? Uh, this is our radar module, left side. There yeah. go. Yeah, left side. Uh, 60 gigahertz? Yeah, 60 gigahertz radar module. And 60 gigahertz is useful for what kind of radio? Um, and, uh, on all the IoT kind of devices? Yeah, this is an evaluation board to easy uh, evaluate about the radar And it will go in the car? Where it will go? Yeah. Those are all the applications? Yeah, we have several target applications. One is uh, in cabin sensing and uh, out cabin sensing for the parking assist and the automated door and the security and the automotive low mower and so on. Uh, many applications. Nice. Um, that's cool. And what else is cool here at the show? Yeah. What else you can show? You can show it? Uh, oh, some other sorry. guy? Yeah. I'm okay. not in charge of other yeah, product. Yeah, yeah. Okay. 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 Thank you. Right. Thank you. Let's go around here. Yeah. Okay. Let's I follow see, you. Like, uh, most interesting demo we show. Yeah. Yes. Hi. Yes. Hi. Hello. What do you show here? Okay. Uh, what what should I do at uh, Okay. What is this? Uh, this is uh, our Murata, Murata AI module. Uh, this module is using uh, Google chipset. Uh, it's called uh, Coral. We are using uh, Murata module for this demo. It's showing uh, human detection. It's showing uh, our arm and our leg and our head. So it's like uh, our body parts, like uh, this one. Like this one. Like this one. And, uh, and this is just, um, this is computer vision, this is uh, uh, just with a camera, yes. and analyze very quick. Yes, right, perfect. And where is the board to do this? Yes, here. This one is uh, our product. You call it the Coral? Yes. It's called the Coral, and uh, it's uh, based on Google chipset. Yes. Well, you work together with Google to make this? Yes. It says the Coral Edge TPU 1WV uh, Ciatec Award. Yes. Four tops. It's a high performance, low power. Is it ARM? Is it ARM CPU? Uh, not ARM CPU. It's using uh, the CPU from uh, Google. It's called the Coral. All right. So it's a different kind of architecture. Yes. Nice. Here is this also. Yes, it's a real module of uh, yeah. Coral. What's the price? Price. Uh, it depends on the quantity, but around 20 20 dollars. Twenty dollars. Uh, yes. And uh, we can buy this module from a website of Google. Oh wow! And uh, we have. It's mass production already. Yes, and uh, we have uh, some type of evaluation board, like uh, this one, and uh, uh, not this one. We have like this one, and uh, like this one. What's happened when people do the QR code? They can get a free board? Uh, not the free no. board, unfortunately. It's More not information, free. yeah? But uh, we can access uh, the website of this board. Nice, and there's more information here? Yes. The and this is performance? Of, performance? Uh, yes. How high is it? The core module is uh, 102 times faster than V4. Or uh, depends what you do, right? Just one, just one. But it's very powerful. It's and uh, yeah. and then you you partner with this uh, with the camera and ah yes you are right uh, they are the partner of uh, they are the customer who is using a core module for camera. So now we have a. Uh, now there are three customers. They are using a camera, and uh, on the website of Google, you can see more customer who who is using a Coral module. Nice. What else? 
is cool here at the booth? What else I should check? What is the coolest demo? <laughs> coolest demo? I think this demo is very nice. Can you speak about this? Yes, it's no problem. Yeah? What is this? It's a demo for our Ultra Wide Man module. Yeah. Ah, okay. And uh, is it this? This is the evaluation board of uh, our module. The, our module is this one. What's the name of this? It's uh, Type 2 AB. This module is based on uh, Corobot chipset, and uh, this module is using uh, Nordic IC. It's included uh, over this module. And, uh, nice. That's with, cool. With this demo, we are using uh, two uh, some, some evaluation board for this. Uh, one is a tag, like this one. It's including uh, Type 2 AB, AB module. What is it? Type 2 AB? In How does it connect? What does it do? In this, in this one, it's working with the coin battery and this board, uh, this board has a uh, Type 2 AB module. And Murata make the batteries? Ah, many, yes. many batteries? This, uh, this battery is made by Murata. Yeah. And uh, this side, is, uh, Anka side, is also using uh, Type 2 AB module. Nice. And uh, we are using uh, five anchors for this demo. One is uh, at here, and one is at here, and uh, at here. And uh, we put uh, one anchor on the wall, like uh, that one. Oh, you have them all around the booth, and yes. then based on that, you can do positioning? Yes, right. We can show the position on the, this map. We have uh, two blue points. It's showing the location of uh, our tag. Nice. Rotation? Yes. If, if I move this tag to boost E... Okay. That's cool. Yes, blue points go boost E. It's very fast. Yes. And it's for all indoor application. Um, uh, can you yes. connect with mobile phones or is not for this kind of t application? About this demo is uh, only for indoor location, but uh, not the use case of uh, ultra wide band is not only indoor location. We can use uh, this module to check uh, distance and to check uh, angles, etc. So, yes. And it works with every BLE, every Bluetooth device will be uh, compatible. Not, not Bluetooth. It's, uh, it's including a Bluetooth, but uh, we are using an ultra wide band to check the locations. And here I see it says hostless Nordic uh, component for the BLE. And then, yeah, I'm trying to understand what devices will be compatible with this indoor network, with this indoor GPS, you know, kind of. Ah, yes, there are some uh, technology to check the locations. For example, one is uh, GPS and uh, one is uh, Bluetooth, but uh, the accuracy of, uh, di to check uh, distance is uh, ultra wideband is the best. Uh, ultra wideband is better than GPS and uh, BLE, so we are using a ultra, ultra wideband for this demo. What is over there? Cellular modules? Uh, <laughs> you can speak about this? Sorry, unfortunately no? I can't oh, Which other one is coolest? At the booth. The cool booth. We have a uh, other demo for yeah, this side, it. but uh, where is that? Where is I think it's I can better. ask your friend. Oh, yes. Do you want to speak about this? Uh, it's, uh, Hi. Uh, so, so what are you showing here? Ultra wideband radar and ranging. Uh, there's like a part you were doing together with NXP. Yep. So uh, based on the NXP ULB IC, we have a uh, uh, modules show. And what do they do? Okay, so pretty As range. a distance? Yeah, range is Connecting with this vibration uh, ball and this tag. Nice. Yeah, so it's a ranging. Wow. It's very accurate. Yeah. It's around the plus minus. How does it work? 
and it's not so possible to do that. Is it uh, pinging? Is it some kind of uh, sonar? No, no, it's, it's a UWB yeah, signal. Like so, you know, what communication. Is shorter, oh, and does it work in different directions or only straight in front? Yeah, maybe like Let me call Berto because Berto from the tree. Have you heard the Berto? It's Are there already yeah. um, applications in the market, yeah. or is it brand new? Uh, no, this every ball is already in market. How much is price? The price is it depends on the like, quantity or <laughs> project. Yeah. And then people can play with it, and they can try to use it. What would be the product at the end? Uh, the end product? Yeah, what could be the end product for this? It is for tag, you have a tag. So it's like, a, you know, air tag is in all the market. So you can put this in your garage on the wall, mm -hmm. and then you, you put your car exactly at zero centimeters from the wall. <laughs> yeah? Because your garage is just limit. Because mm -hmm. you have an American car, it's a little bit too long. <laughs> Something like that? Yeah, it's rebooting, huh? The Raspberry Pi, you're yeah. rebooting that one, something. So that's cool. But we, we just, I just saw it. We just saw it. Which other part of the booth do you think I should film? That's really cool. Uh, do you have some idea? What should I film here? Uh, what's the next? Oh, okay, I'll just walk around. Okay. So that was here. So we are eating his power. Here's stuff to do with the software. Hi. Do you want to speak about this on video? Okay. In a main interview? Okay. Yeah? Uh, so, what is this software here? Uh, this is the code of Femitet. Uh, this is the CAE software. Yeah? And uh, we can do uh, this kind of this software, including these eight solvers. You know, so, so what is for designing? Designing for. Uh, Design for yeah, application itself, lots of applications like this. It's Machine very advanced, know, right? Yes. It's to calculate the heat, heat the thermal, thermal mechanical, mechanical, fluid, electromagnetic, fluid. magnetic, electric field, piezo, acoustic. All nice. the uh, So what is missing? Here. Which part you don't have? Atomic. Ah. No? <laughs> no need. No need. <laughs> so it's yeah. like everything that happens yes. to um, something concrete, something real, in uh, industrial or yes. industrial, maybe. Yes. All right. But not, not military, except the military. Yeah. 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 It's so peace. Yes. Peace in the world. Sure. Nobody needs to measure anything to do yeah. with the military. Exactly. And there's. Uh, it looks like magnets or oh, this coils. Is the, and this is the coil. Yeah? The toroidal coil, coil, and it's just a winding. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Very cool. simple. Simple design. Nice. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Thanks a lot. Thanks. And here we see, do you know uh, if anybody can speak about this? Uh, let's try to do some video right here with the wireless uh, ecosystem. Hi. Hi. Uh, please introduce yourself. Hi. Uh, okay. You can sit. Okay. Hi. I'm Anders Roswald from uh, Embedded Artists, and we are a partner to Maratha. Uh, so. <clears throat> You make these? Yeah, we we and the and the green. Where are you based? We're based in Sweden. And you make PCB design? Yeah. So we we are a company that uh, makes uh, computer modules. Uh, so we do both computer modules and Wi-Fi and Bluetooth modules, where we use the Murata modules, and yeah. and then we add uh, PCB yeah. in the M M.2 form factor. Is it different boards or the same? So, what are we looking at here? Uh, yeah. So we have a lot of different uh, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth options. They are in the M.2 form factor. And that makes a perfect fit for evaluating the different options. Uh, you can evaluate the different modules with performance and cost and, uh, and uh, power consumption, for example. So you have a bunch of NXP? Exactly. Yeah. 
uh, we only work with the i.mx family from NXP, so we are specialized in the NXP application and uh, microcontroller processors. Is this the powerful one? Exactly, this is the newest one that we have just released, that's the i.mx93. It's uh, just a few days old, so to say. <clears throat> so what is a partnership you have with the Murata? They have some different parts that go on there? So uh, we started out with Murata to develop the M.2 form factor to, uh, I mean, seamless wireless integration for the i.mx family is the title of this uh, uh, display card. So we, we are working on making this really easy when you want to evaluate the Wi-Fi module for the i.mx family. We have the Linux BSP is completely ready to go. You uh, just hit the on button and then you have the drivers and everything in place. You don't need to uh, recompile the kernel or anything to get things started. And your Linux is very stable? Yeah, absolutely. We work with the latest one that, uh, uh, that NXP releases. So three times a year there comes, or oh, well, four times a year, I mean, there comes the new Linux BSP. There's been a lot support. of uh, developments in the Linux mm -hmm. for the embedded in the last few years, right? Yeah, yeah definitely. Yeah. We, we find it very stable. Uh, we haven't uh, heard any problems for, from any one of our uh, customers. What is this board here? So this is the e-evaluation e platform. The, the black part here is the uh, uh, we call it the carrier board. That's a reference design for the uh, end customer's uh, carrier board. So you can use this as a starting point to design your own hardware. And uh, how do you connect, uh, where do you connect the stuff on these? And how so, does it work? What is the standard so on the, of bottom, the so, size? So on the bottom side, there is uh, uh, Hiroshi uh, DF40C connectors. That's a, a more or less a, a standard in the in, in industry to use these connectors. And uh, here at the Murata booth, you're talking a lot about all the different solutions that are... Exactly, and we, exactly, we have solution for the Matter protocol also. So uh, this is a development platform based around the i.mx 8 Mini, and we have the 2EL uh, um, module here that also both supports Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and thread. That's the, the, the three wireless technologies that is supported by the Matter. It's uh, very trendy, the Matter, and yeah, exactly. a lot of people are working with this. Yeah, exactly. And, uh, and this is the display of the three different platforms where, that you can use from Murata to get started immediately with your development work. And where in Sweden are you based? So we are based in the south of Sweden, in the Malmö region. So just next to Copenhagen. Exactly. Do you have any Danish working in the company? No, uh, no, we don't, but, uh, but we would love are to Are you have. a big company? <laughs> no, we are a very small company, actually. Uh, how many years have you been working on the embedded? We have been in business for uh, 23 years, actually, and we've been working very closely with both NXP and Murata for many, many years. Nice. This is a great show, no? They are very busy. Exactly. Like, uh, a lot of people coming. Show. Exactly. It's a real nice thing to see now after COVID also. They're, so uh, the floor is packed, really. Nice. That's awesome. Okay. Thank tack you very much. Yeah, tack. <laughs> yeah, tack. Yeah. All right. right. Uh, Do you know if something cool here, the booth that I didn't cover? I'll need to go around. Uh, maybe the... I'll try, I'll try these exactly guys the already. Maybe the AI also may... Okay. Might be tack. You see? Okay. okay. Tack. What can you show us? And uh, here is something about the geolocalization yeah. and Laura. logger that runs there. And I'm, right. I'm envisioning that we have a PCI the same right. uh, uh, Did you have uh, some secrets uh, in the meeting room you want to show? No? <laughs> Nothing okay. secrets in the meeting room. Okay, <laughs> okay. thanks a yeah. lot. Okay. Thank you. Yes. Okay, thank you. There we are. All right, so um, please wait around for one second. I'll be right back with the live stream. Did you, did you get the card? You got? Okay. Uh, so, uh, from did you get our, their card? Can yeah. I have your email contact? Yes, yeah. I do.
and it was live on the internet. Oh, but yeah. tonight published in 4K. Yes. Okay. Yes. Thank you. And if you want to invite us, we come to Japan. We make videos, you know. Yeah. At, are you going to be at the Seatec? No, I'm not. But uh, the company, right? Yeah, the company. So maybe the company want to invite us to make videos at the Seatec. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Ah, what can I help if you want? Because we did all these cool uh, booths. Yeah. Maybe you can send me an email with a description what text I should use. Okay. Otherwise, I will go on your website. But if you want, you send me. Email. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. -bye. Do you need to do this video? Yes. Okay. Um, did you get that contact? Did you get that? Yeah, did you get that? Fine. The Swedish guy, I just saw uh, Yeah. Hi. Um, Tell it again. Yeah, yeah, I have that. Yeah. This is the Video is live, and it will go here also. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Ah. So uh, if you want to send me a description yeah. of what I should use, I can separate yeah. your video. No, it's so not. It's part of the Murata booth, but so I will also, I can make video just with you. Yeah. If you send me an email. Yeah. So, it is still a little bit quiet outside of yeah. it. Wait for a second. Hey, what did you say? Your the the microphone? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Of course. Okay. Okay. Bye. Okay. Great. Thank you. Uh, I know what the is. So what time is it? What did you have here? Yeah, but they kind of said no. Where? So it's one o'clock and it's tech talk time at the embedded world and my expert is very uh, What day was this? Thursday, no? Can I do a video with you? Okay, yeah. any, any questions? <laughs> yeah, I'll ask you in the video, yeah? Yeah, all right. One second. Where is this uh, <laughs> published? Yeah, uh, we will give you the card right now. Okay. One second. Oh.